In this gripping drama, Songyo has long harbored secret feelings for Sokryu during their teenage years. Despite the depth of his emotions, he kept them hidden, valuing their friendship above all. When a time capsule they buried years ago is opened, Songyo is stunned to see his past self writing his feelings for Sokryu. He's frustrated with himself for leaving proof of his emotions. Ten years ago, Songyo, Sokryu, and their friend Moyum wrote letters to their future selves. Songyo hinted in his letter that he might have confessed his feelings to Sokryu. Now, a decade later, he tries to convince himself those feelings are long gone. Unbeknownst to him, Moyam had already dug up the time capsule the night after they buried it and read the letters. This means she might know about Songyo's past feelings for Sokryu. The plot thickens as Songyo and Sokryu start working together again when Sokryu's old company, Grape, connects with Atelier Inn. Meanwhile, Moyum and Danho, now neighbors, clash over their similar tastes, but these disagreements might just turn into something more meaningful. Tensions rise when Chris, a former grape colleague of Sokryu, makes a shocking appearance. Songyo confronts Chris aggressively, pushing him against a wall, enraged by something Chris said about Sokryu. Sokryu and Myungwoo try to intervene, revealing just how far Songyo will go to protect his best friend. The real question remains, what did Sokryu write in her letter to her future self? Did she harbor feelings for Songyo too?